Hi people, how's it going? Hey, Biscuit's back. We are back in Tarant. We'll talk to this guy. Get our ship fixed. Oh my god. Trade me, please. You have nothing that's damaged. Why are you wearing that stuff? Stop it. Okay, give me that. You have nothing that's damaged. Now that's cursed. Okay, I know you're naked. I know you're naked. Is that it? What is it that you want of me? Trade. Okay, and boots. So, oh, and it is. Yeah. All right. Oh, yes. Okay. That, give me this. Let's go. Go up, go up by one. Oh my god. The daggers. that one, fix that one, and fix that one. Okay. Weird. Let me look at your trade goods. Three hundred twenty-three coins. Oh yeah, we have to sell the weapons to him. So the magic people won't take them. We need to go to. Need to sell this. Sell those. And sell uh, that necklace. So he was going to give us 323 for it. Is there a jewelers here? Gears and gadgetry. Let's see if we can. Uh, we're allowed in here now. Oh dear, you cannot come into my shop. Yeah, that's right, dog. I'm gonna have to sell everything to the friggin' junk dealer. Seriously? Uh, the fine clothing shop. Let's try this one. Thank you for honoring me with your return. Yep, you know that. Okay. General store. Not interested? What?
trade for me, please. Okay, he has three. You get these, because you're a pussy. And I don't like you. Come here. Virgil. some healing potions. Scroll. Go down, push. Oh my god, scroll. There. Thank Jeebus. Okay, where's the nearest way to get to the junk dealer? Okay, up here. Go. So we're going to sell a schematic at the junk dealer. We're going to go across town again and see Stevie Nicks and check out her potions and stuff. Barter. Take it. Accept it. Be part of it. Oh. I don't know what I was thinking that was. Something else. Inventory. Eddie. Eddie. Double daggers. Whatever. Close enough. To Stevie Nicks. Then we'll run all the way back to the inn. We'll drop off some stuff. Pick up another Cathorn crystal. Because we need that for. Um, there's a naked man. There's a half naked man. Half orc thief. Alright, you go over there. You be over there. You be Oh shit, it just got dark out. I want to get uh, potions up too. I don't remember if I said that. Hello, Stevie. Uh, shall we barter? Sense of intellect. Let's buy that. Okay. Uh, yeah. Man, I wish I could fast travel over to the other side of town. <laughs> so lazy. Now that it's nighttime, we will probably get attacked. That's okay. I don't mind. They try anything and it's going to go down. I think it's just a straight shot from here to the hotel. Well, to the street with the hotel on it. And after that, we'll head to Black Root and we'll talk to uh, the expert at Dodge. I got to check to see how much money I got. Hello. And the money, 10,000 gold. I'm down with that. I'm down with that. Magic leather armor. Okay. Well, let's save. And we will head to Black Root.
spells. Teleportation. Oh, yes! Stop in here, have a nap. And save, cause you know, anything could happen, the game could crash or something. Guys could get a little fris frisky. Ah, there we go. Thirty, level twenty-eight, level seventeen, go biscuit. Uh is his first name Herman? Herman Ogdoppler. Ogmeyer. I think he's over here somewhere. Well maybe not here. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I am going the right way. My brain is good. Dude, dude, stop! There we go. Herkimer Ogdodler. There's a name for you. I'd like to discuss training. As I've said, it's for 500 coins. You must be an apprentice already, and you must have sufficient skill. Can you train me in dodge, please? And here is your 500 gold. Your training is complete. Is there anything else? Who could train me to be a master of dodge? Incredible as it seems, the dodge master is a blind hermit named Adkin Chambers. He's blinded and disfigured in a duel by an unchivalrous blow that was delivered after he'd yielded. Such things are expected in war, but not in a trial of arms. Now he hides himself from society in the outskirts of Stillwater. Who was the asshole that pulled this bullshit? Chambers was blinded in a duel with Garrick Stout. Chambers was defending the honor of his betrothed, a beautiful and virtuous lady known as Lady D. Druella. The details are shameful to me, and I will not speak of them. Trial by combat proved Stout's innocence as he was victorious. However, he disgraced himself by attacking after his opponent had yielded. Is Garrick Stout the Garrick Stout that's the head of the guard at Durnholm? He's the master of melee. He's proven himself the best in numerous passages of arms. His skill is legendary and respected throughout Arcanum, but his prowess has bred conceit into his character. It's regrettable that so many seek him for his wisdom. It's a pity. Arrogance is a fool's luxury. He's a craftsman, unchivalrous and lecherous in his affairs. If abandoning all that is pure and good is the consequence of mastery, then I shall never pursue it. I could learn nothing from such a man. He still lives in Durnholm, I believe. They have made him captain of the guard. Same guy. I can remember what his position was held by honorable men. Disgusting. Well, we know where Durnholm is. We've been there. He'll get what's coming to him, I'm sure. Eventually. Is there anything else? Anything interesting happening? This is the place to come if you're looking to purchase a boat. I'll see ya. There we go. We're now an expert. One more point in Dex. One more point in this, and I think we can go train with the Master of Dodge. Now, let me go check the... The tailor shop? What else is in Black Root? Train that we can't take because of biscuit. We can't go into many of the other shops because we're too magical. Oh, it's magic, you know. Alright, down here. Taylor, sweetheart.
back again? You keep this up, Carolyn, and they'll never be able to shut me up over at the pub. I have too much bragging to do. What with you visiting my shop regular and all, what can I do for you? Let's trade. Do you have a dress like mine, only in a lot better condition? Do I have to steal it from you? Enchanted gown. Mmm. Mmm-mmm. -mm. Thank you. Wait, let's give her something to really brag about. Let's save. And I guess we're going to go to Ashbury. Here's something you can talk about at the pub. Aw, oh, yes. Woohoo! Check the shops before we head out. Hmm. No, that looks to be it. What is it that you want of me? Trade me up. Honey child. Let's give him this as an extra. Crooked staff, check in there. Let's barter. Well, we got three scrolls of exiting. I think we're good. What is it that you want of? And yeah, I'm shorting Dante out. Fuck him, he's an asshole. There. And lastly, we'll check the, the uh, fine clothing shop. We'll see if they've got any fine clothing. Nope. Got some nice stuff, but no fine clothing. All right, up to Edward Teach and the magic boat. Got rid of the body, but the blood stain's still there. Ooh. Wait a minute. Where's the elven dude? The elven trader, isn't he here? Ah, yes, he's right there. Let's go down there. He's the one with the booby statue. Interesting. Elven boots. Hmm. Hmm. Nah. We're good. Let's go. Let's save. We'll talk to him <coughs> tomorrow, which will be Wednesday. I'm recording this ahead, sorry. So if you could leave a like, that would be awesome. I will see you Wednesday for more Arcanum. We're going to talk to this guy, who I think is Edward Teach. And then we're going to head off to the Isle of Despair. Woo!